Welcome back to my channel. I'm finally doing a review video for my Up A Baby Minu stroller. I have been wanting to do this for a while. We bought it um, in December. And the only reason we bought it was because we were moving up north and I knew that we would be traveling a lot by plane if we wanted to go anywhere with the girls, visit family, go on trips. And if we weren't flying, then we were going to be driving. And we had the Up A Baby Vista, which I love 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 and i probably wouldn't have survived with um without with uh, having two under two that stroller is amazing for going to the mall with both kids i'm um, doing quick grocery shops where you can just quickly click in your infant car seat and put your toddler in the front and grab some stuff for the huge basket so i definitely loved our Apple baby vista but it is a full size stroller so it takes up a lot of room and i wasn't comfortable flying with it and it getting wrecked because it is um, an investment to say the least. So I wanted to get something that would be easy to travel with by plane and vehicle. Um, traveling with two kids for an extended period of time means a lot of stuff, pack and plays, extra bags, diapers, the works. So I wanted something that would be compact enough to fit into the back of our vehicle, fit into the back seat, um, behind a seat and be able to bring onto the plane just so they can check it right away um, and it doesn't have to go in the baggage area. So we went with the Epa Baby Minu and this stroller can turn into a travel system with an infant car seat. You just have to remove the seat and you could attach a buggy board to it, a universal one to accommodate a toddler on top of your infant sitting in the seat or the car seat. Epa Baby does not make a stroller board for this stroller but there are some universal options we don't have one yet so i can't um, make any comments about that but there is a couple that work for this stroller um, so i'm going to go over the features of it and what i think about it but so far i am very impressed with it i'm very happy with it as far as outside all-terrain stroller this is a small travel lightweight stroller this is not something that you're gonna go off-roading with i'm going to get into it now this model of the menu is in the Jordan color with a silver frame and like I said before this can turn into a travel system. You just need a adapter and it can be used with the Uppa Baby Mesa, the Maxi Cozy, Nuna Pippa and Cybex infant car seats or you can also buy a from birth kit which is a bassinet that can click in and you can use it from newborn. The canopy does have an extendable sunshade and then there's also the peekaboo window at the very top. You have your multi-position recline and then a five-point harness. Like other Uppa Baby strollers, you do have the magnetic peekaboo window so that when your baby is sleeping, you can just quietly peek at them and you don't have to deal with the Velcro ripping sound. This stroller does come with a built-in pouch on the back. You can comfortably have your phone, keys, wallet, um, and whatever you need for your baby. And then the recline is just a one-handed two-push and it comes all the way down. This is a great position for when your toddler or older baby needs to sleep, but it's also great for a younger baby who can't quite sit up just yet and needs to have a more reclined position. The brake system is sandal friendly, so you don't have to hurt the top of your feet. You can just quickly press the go one and then press the brake when you need to do that. The storage basket has a 20 pound capacity. It is quite large and you get access from front and back. You can purchase a cup holder accessory separately, which we have, but of course I didn't have it on for this demonstration, but we do have one. This is by far my favorite feature of this stroller. It is a one-handed collapse. All you do is slide and push and fold the stroller forward, and you can easily do this one-handed. So if you have your baby on your hip or um, your other hand is full, you can quickly just do it with one hand and go. And then this stroller also has a carrying strap with a padded shoulder um, pad at the top so it just sits comfortably on your shoulder. 
So that is it for the Uppa Baby Minu demonstration. Overall, we love this stroller. We love that it has the aspects of a full-size stroller, making it into a travel system with an infant car seat, but then it is also super lightweight, weighing at only 14.8 pounds. You can travel with it, you can stick it in small spaces. It is still maneuverable, it is lightweight, it's easy to push. Overall, I just think it's a really great stroller. So thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this review video, please like and subscribe.